march right back at you, all of you. I appreciate it. Well, today is Earth Day. Happy Earth Day to everyone here and to everyone out there. We, uh, we celebrate Earth Day uh, today, of course, because uh, it is the Earth's birthday. Happy birthday, Earth. Um, <laughs> It's also the day when we take time to think about our planet and in turn think about all the planets until we can think about nothing else but Uranus. <laughs> Earth Day is a, it's a great day to think about how important nature is. I love spending time in nature. I, I really do. I love being outdoors. Yesterday I did yoga outside and I ate breakfast outside and I showered outside. And <laughs> What I'm trying to say is I locked myself out of the house. <laughs> but I would spend all the time outside if I could, all the time, except if it's windy, then there's the risk of chafing. And uh, I can't risk that, because if I chafe my lips, I can't talk, and if I can't talk, I can't host the show, and if I can't host the show, the world falls apart. So, um, yeah. the more time you spend outside, the more you realize how many amazing things there are to appreciate on Earth. Uh, there's the sky and the, the trees and the rare, extraordinary species like uh, the red-crowned Amazon parrot or the California condor or the Cindy Lopper. Uh, <laughs> all the rare things. The other day, uh, Portia was convinced that she discovered a brand new species of animal behind our house. And uh, she said she'd never seen anything like it before. I didn't see it. She saw it and called to me and I ran and I, I didn't get there in time, but she just described it and she said it had tiny, tiny eyes close together and a hairy face and I said, Cousin Judy's here. And, <laughs> and she can't figure out what she saw but uh, when she initially saw it she told me she said it looked like either a wild boar or a wild warthog and I reminded her that we don't live on an African game reserve <laughs> yet. But uh, then she started showing me pictures of things that it might be, and she said, do you think it was this? And, uh, and, I, sa and I said, no, I doubt it, because that's an aardvark. And then she said, well, maybe this, and I said, that's an anteater. So basically, we've narrowed it down to either a prehistoric animal or a squirrel. It's one of those two things. <laughs> but what I'm hoping to do is I'm going to get in touch with a sketch artist, and uh, I'm going to have Portia uh, come on the show, hopefully tomorrow, and she's going to describe what she saw. And uh, I'm excited to see what the artist comes up with, but based on Portia's description, she, probably it will be drawn as our cat. Um, <laughs> maybe she saw our cat. <laughs> I don't know. From the Warner Brothers Studios, here she is now, Ellen DeGeneres. I would never ask my followers to do anything that I would not do myself. So, I made some examples, and uh, let's, um, where are they? All right, so this is made entirely out of old, these are actually from my mama's house, recycled beer cans. And, Hilarious and the host of Fox's The Wanda Sykes Show. Please welcome Emmy Award winner Wanda Sykes. Nothing. And, nothing. and, and are they talking yet? And are they? Yeah. Like, well, well, okay. You can't really say what that what Lucas is doing. It's that's not talking. It's just a, a, a series of grunts. Just, ah, ah, you know. But but you know we can communicate with him. He's really really a, a, a smart guy, and and everything is fascinating to him. So it, whenever he sees something new, he gets really excited. He just goes. It's like it's like watching porn for the first uh -huh. time. Everything. Happy Earth Day, everybody! Next, all new Ellen. She's an actress, a singer, a dancer, and I think a dental hygienist. <laughs> the amazing Jennifer Lopez. And 13-year-old Chloe Moretz from the new movie that kicks a uh, butt. New music from Nora Jones, plus the latest American Idol cast-off. Now I'm getting invested and I'm getting attached to these kids and then they go away and I'm... So they're all going to end up living with me, I'm sure. All new Ellen.